Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x square minus y square is equal to 9. xy is equal to 20. To find the values of x plus y from these two systems of equations. Now, in the first step, we we'll start by letting this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Then, from this equation 1, which is x square minus y square is equal to 9. In the first step, we'll start by squaring in both sides. Then, the square of x square minus y square will expand this. It will be x square, then bracket square, plus y square, bracket square, then minus 2, x square times y square is equal to 9 square, it is 81. Then in the next step, it will be x square times square is power 4, plus y square times square is power 4, then minus 2, into here x square y square is same as x y, then bracket square is equal to this 81. Then in the next step, it will be x power of 4, plus y power of 4 minus 2 into here xy inside the bracket is from equation 2 xy is equal to 20 so into here we we'll substitute 20 then bracket square is equal to 81 then it will be x power of 4 plus y power of 4 is equal to this 81 then from here 20 square is 400. 400 times 2 is 800. So it will be negative 800. We'll take into this side. It will be plus 800. Then it will be x power of 4 plus y power of 4 is equal to this plus this. It will be 881. So this will call this equation 3. Then in the next step, from here, we already get this x power 4 plus y power 4 is equal to this value. Now, to get this x power 4 plus y power 4, we'll use, we'll expand the rule, which is x square plus y square bracket square. So, we'll expand this so as to get x power 4 plus y power 4. So, it will be equal to x square bracket square plus y square bracket square, then plus 2 x square y square then it will be x square plus y square then bracket square is equal to x then square times square is power 4 plus y square times square is power 4 then plus 2 into here x square y square is same as x y then bracket square then in the next step it will be x square plus y square then bracket square is equal to into here x square plus y square is from equation 3 which is this 881 so he into here we substitute 881 then plus 2 xy is from equation 2 xy is equal to 20 so into here we substitute 20 then bracket square so it will be x square plus y square then bracket square is equal to 881 plus this 20 square is 400. 400 times 2 is 800. So it will be x square plus y square then bracket square is equal to this plus this is it will be 16 then 81. Then to get x square plus y square, here we have this square, so we'll apply square root in both sides. So this square root will cancel square, then it will be this, which is x square plus y square is equal to plus or minus. The square root of this 1681, here we'll divide by 2, square root of 16, it is 4. So here it will be 4, then 4 times 2 is 8. Here we add 1, 1. Now 1 times 81 is this 81. 
so it will be over so the square root of this number is 41 so it will be plus or minus 41 then into this equation here this we call this equation 4 then in the next step to get this x square y square we'll apply the rule which is x plus y bracket square whereas we are going to find this x plus y the expansion of this it is equal to x square plus y square plus 2xy so it will be x plus y bracket square is equal to x square plus y square it is this so it will be plus or minus 41 then plus 2 xy xy is from equation 2 in our problem which is xy it is 20 so it will be here 20 then it will be x plus y bracket square is equal to this time this is 40 then plus or minus 41 then in the next step from here we have two solutions because of plus or minus so it will be x plus y bracket square is equal to from the first solution when it is positive to be 40 plus 41 which is 81 and the second solution this which is x plus y bracket square is equal to when it is negative it will be 40 minus 41 which is negative 1 then we'll apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel square then it will be this which is x plus y is equal to square root of 81 is plus or minus 9 so this is the first solution whereas we have plus or minus 9 and from here we'll apply square root in both sides so this square root will cancel this square then it will be this which is x plus y is equal to square root of negative 1 it is i so here x plus y it is i which is a complex solution therefore the conclusion from our problem the first value of x plus y x plus y is equal to this when it is positive to be equal to 9 and the other value of x plus y is equal to this negative 9 and the third value of x plus y is equal to this i so we have two real solutions two real solution of x plus y and one complex solution of x plus y so these are all our solutions in this our problem thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye